Show me your speed. What's going on, guys? We're gonna bring you a little quick, quickie, quickie video. Uh, so let's see. We have fourteen days, sixteen hours till the new season starts. Uh, and the new seasons. <clears throat> Excuse me. As the new season starts, before the new season starts, whatever tokens you have, as far as tokens you get from strikes or crucible, spend them all now because they're going to be worthless and during as soon as next season starts. Um, see, I, I have none here. It, it, it took me a good probably thirty minutes, maybe. To spend all my tokens that I had for on uh, Lord Shax. I don't remember how many I had. Probably a good twenty five hundred, maybe. <clears throat> Which is good because it gives you legendary shards, obviously. Um, so you're gonna want to do the same thing. I saw four thousand something here. That's Oh my, wow. So yeah, you just want to spend them all. Just go to town. I'm not going to do them all, obviously, here, but I'm just showing you guys. Um, what you're, you're going to want to do here, because they're going to be worthless, so might as well just spend them. Because they're doing a whole new rep reputation or rank-up system for next season, so... Like I said, if you have them, get rid of them before the season ends, or else they're going to be worthless. Let me know what you guys think about what they're doing, as far as what Bungie's doing with the new season, and just everything in general. I've come to the realization that I just, I can't play Destiny the way I used to. Destiny 1... I'd get on and I'd play and fall asleep in my game chair and sad to say that I can't do that anymore. I mean, even just doing pinnacles. I mean, yeah, I'll make Zer videos and everything else, but <clears throat> other than that, man, I just, I wish they would add something to the game like they did in D1, you know what I mean? Like, strike specific loot. I know they have like one, you know, they have certain weapons or whatever, but I'll, I'll make it the way D1 was. You know what I'm saying? Like the vendors in the tower have, they're absolutely worthless. You know what I mean? They shouldn't even be there. Bring it back to the way D1 was, <clears throat> where you go to each vendor every week. They have different rolled weapons. Do it that way. Add something into where I could keep. It'll keep me on the game. And I can grind for stuff. It's because <laughs> now it's like I come on here and it's like I got everything from the raid I want except for the hand cannon. I don't have the hand cannon. I have everything else I want as far as that goes, but there's nothing for me to grind for. Nothing for me to do. I don't care about getting a higher power level because at the end of the season, that's going to be taken away because each season there's a new artifact. So it's just it's it's just pointless. You know, I'll get up to whatever the normal power level is, and then I'll stop. Like, I see some people that are, like, at 1,300, and I understand those probably die-hard players, but... Anyway, yeah, spend your coins while you have them before the season ends. And, uh, that's it. Um, I might keep that. Um, other than that... The only thing I'm going to be doing is the Hawk Moon thing each week until I get the roll I want. I would like to get one for Crucible whenever they allow me back in Crucible or Gambit. I have a restriction still. It was supposed to be... Oh, no, they took it off. Okay. Uh, they must have just took it off. It was supposed to be two weeks. It ended up being three weeks because my internet's so bad. But, uh, yep, hope you guys enjoyed it. <clears throat> Spend those tokens and... Uh, Talk to you guys later.